yesterday. So I was going to um, modify our login system or connection system and I was getting some weird error for uh, the data structure but when I tested the, the project with another version I it just works fine so let me just host the server here and connect to it okay so now we have two clients connected to the server and actually can have more so I've changed the max clients to four right now and okay let's connect to the server okay so now we have three connected clients therefore I spawn a player here okay and here now this uh, client cannot spawn his player because this is one versus one match and we already have two players on the game but he always can spectate the game so in the older version I think it was um, 1.4 uh, 40 51 I guess um, I was getting some weird error about the uh, about uh, this script connect and disconnect and actually there was an error here so yeah for DS map you need to do uh, instead of this map remove or what was that um, destroy I guess yes you need to um, actually delete the socket Okay, so uh, yeah, and what I'm doing here is let me just show you something. Um, now for the server, I have um, three variables here: global locked current players, spectators, and connected clients. Okay, and I'm just sending it to the clients. Okay. So I'm sending the sprites, which is the global of current players. I'm sending also the current players, the connected clients, spectators, and server type, of course. Now in the client, um, so I'm receiving the, this data here. Okay, and of course I've created the values here. Now finally in the join menu, so you're going to check for before joining you're going to check if the players are less than two okay so if the players are less than two then you can connect to the server Act actually you can spawn your player and the same thing for the spectat uh, button so we're going to see if there is actually um, less than two spectators then we can spectate the game and actually yeah that's all I did but I still wondering why did I get those weird errors about the data structures but yeah so here whenever a clients connect then the connected clients will increase by one whenever client disconnect uh, the connected clients will decrease by one okay and also have this receive data script which is uh, so let me show you something uh, okay, in the client when we press uh, the spectat button then we're going to send on um, this key to the server and we are, when we send it, then the spectators will increase by one, and that's all actually. Yep. So, I suggest you to update your Game Maker version to 1.4.5067, uh, which is the, I think it's the last uh, update until now. And yeah. So now, um, 
Well, let's give this tutorial a little bit longer and let's make some uh, auto disconnect when the server shut down. So let's make a SCR a script called SCR send ping. By the way, I will put the link in the description in case you wanna uh, download this, the project or you can check the codes. Okay, oops, that's and okay. Send in the ping to the server to keep the client connected. Okay, so as always, we need to seek the buffer. Okay, buffer, buffer seek start zero. Oops. So let's buffer right, buffer, buffer up. Uh, oh my god. Oops. Buffer and sign it eight and pick. Okay, so let's quickly define this so pink it's for and they also have this uh, constants here which is just for um, the spec that option and buffer oh, oh no so in order to send the ping let's see var ping equals network send packet um, socket buffer and the size is always buffer tail buffer okay now let's say if ping is less than or equals to zero then we basically have lost connections so I'll show message uh, connection loss or something then game restart and one more thing so here the client uh, I have a game and event which basically destroy the list, the buffer, and the socket. Okay. Now let's make an alarm here. Alarm zero, and let's give it a uh, room speed times three. So we're going to send the ping every three seconds. Alarm zero. So let's um. Send ping. Okay. So here we wanna keep sending the alarm. Okay. So yep. Where is it? Oops, this is another error. Well. So let's create the application again. Okay, whoops, where is it? Okay, I think it's... No, it's this one. quickly host the server here and let's join now yep, let's spawn a player and another one so this is the server now if I shut the server after three uh, three seconds okay the client will have this message which tells us that we have lost the connection and then game will restart basically 
help. So this was all for today guys, don't forget to like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Don't forget that you can find the GMZ in the description in case you have some really weird error as I have. So yeah, oh by the way I've tested uh, this project in two other versions and it works fine. So I don't know why it didn't work for the version um, 1.4. Point uh, forty fifty one, I guess. Yep. So, yeah, uh, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.